Okay, we are. Uh, we've had our five minutes, and we need quite a lot longer because people have been doing all kinds of things. Um, but we're going to do. I'm going to change that. We're going to do three times three minutes. Getting starting easy and getting harder, partly to to give us time to. I was going to do two eights, but chat. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Because there's important stuff going on here. <laughs> so I've changed it slightly. So I might do two of those actually. So we're starting now. You've got three minutes to start easy and work your way up. Um, because Esther, that just sounds absolutely phenomenal. And Liz, you were you on the weekend? Yes, yeah. Oh, it sure was. <laughs> oh yes, and Jill was guiding. So Jill what, was, what happened? What oh, are you she, was, to? she was fab, honestly. She taught me lots and lots of things. Right. <laughs> Which I'll keep secret. Huh? No, <laughs> <laughs> no, it was brilliant. It was really good. Yeah, Paddy was fab. Oh, was Jill, Jill was fab. Everyone was fab. So, was I've got running again. I've got running again as well. So, oh, ah, good. Yeah, that's uh, great. Oh, well yeah. done, Liz. Yeah, yeah. I've, I've, yeah. I was with Paul and Phil, the two new guys, so, and they were really good. Excellent. Um, One great. minute gone. So we're well, well, to to them, Kat, had it already said, but I could see um, when he was explaining to them how to coach swimming, there was just this whole rabbit in the headlights. Liz, how much swimming did you do? By the end of the weekend, they were amazing. Yeah, oh, brilliant. Yeah. brilliant. Really good. Really good. Super impressed with them. Yeah. Right. Well, I'll pass on that. His, his um, impact obviously has... So to them at the wrap at the end of the day, yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's good to see. It's really good to see. Oh, that's mm. great. You Go know, on, Linda. Have coaches, if you're autistic, yeah. I was asking how much running Liz did. You what, sorry? Um, how much running did you do? Not far. It was about, uh, I don't know, four kilometres, five kilometres. But That's like, not bad as a starter. It's all pretty yeah. good now. Yeah. It was walk run now I did to you know Good. and we were doing um, um, one more what, minute the tempo tempo is it yeah now you what should be on your you were on your last minute so but it was oh really gosh, nice it ran it was um it was real flat and um um the psychopath on Ken in near Canfor uh, was it Kampoff? No, Kendall. Was it on tarmac, mm. Liz? Yeah, I can't remember it was now. <laughs> was it tarmac or was mm. it, well, was it off-road? It was the, the Ken, part of the Kendall try where you go past the school along the cycle track. Oh, okay, yeah. Along the there. Path. Yeah. Canal path, sorry. And then the second day was um, near the motorway. It was it, like it, um, just the quiet piece of road just off the A590. Um, yes, it's a bridal way, but it's tarmac. Yeah. Um, yes. Sam, Sam Ling? That's something like that, yeah. <laughs> Steve knows where it is. Because we were talking about it. Right, that's your three minutes, so we go back to easy and build it up again. Which obviously you've all been doing because you can talk really clearly. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's really brilliant. Everything was brilliant, yeah. <laughs> Nice. And I didn't put any weight on either. Because <laughs> <laughs> there was no push, please. <laughs> what, sorry? <laughs> what did you say, sorry? Because there was no crisps this week. Oh, no crisps. Yeah, that was it. Ah. <laughs> Lots of cake, but no crisps. Lots yeah. of cake, yeah. Is a yeah, I hear Paddy got a birthday cake. So yeah, that was did you nice. Not, did you not have a day? Do you not get any taken home? No, <laughs> you ate it all. <laughs> oh, okay. uh, not, I'm not big on cake, so it's okay. Oh. Right, you've had a minute, so you want to now be in kind of medium. I thought I thought I was the only one that wasn't a real cake lover. No, oh, Linda, I don't do loads of cake. I mean, I can eat cake, but I'm not that bothered. I cake or kettle cake. crisps? Kettle crisps. I can eat oh, both of those. <laughs> I wonder why I feel sick and then eat another one. Cake <laughs> or chocolate? Chocolate. Halfway through. Cake or chocolate? Um, 
no, it depends. Mm. Depends what the cake is. Uh, <laughs> I like the icing, but not the cake. Ah, <laughs> so you like the sugar. <laughs> <laughs> Teresa? Yeah. Um, down Bristol Way, I think there's somebody who's interested in guiding, but she can't get up all the way to us. Okay. And I, want, I wondered if you two were talking about the fact you've got one minute left, so this bit should be hard unless you're trying to talk to me. Um, <laughs> whether, because you were talking about that you've got a bit of a group of guides. Yeah. And between you, you quite often go running or, or that group works as a kind of semi-coherent yeah. group of people. And I wondered whether it was merit in maybe trying to join her up so that one of them yeah. could, could show her what to do. Is, is she on um, uh, Facebook? Yes. Yes, if um, we've got a Facebook page, VI uh, Runners Bristol. VI yeah, Runners Bristol, brilliant. Uh, is she um, joins that and... Um, she can just put a post or, um, like, Jeff, he's, like, one of the admin. Um, yeah, we meet up every Wednesday. Brilliant. Um, so she can come along and, like, just come and run um, with the group. Like, uh, like she could shadow yeah. for the first time, have a bit of a go. Okay, relax, guys. So, yeah. We're about 30 seconds and then we're going to do the sprints. Uh, that sounds ideal, Teresa, because I, yeah. Steve and I raced at the weekend and I put pictures up and she came back to me going, oh, I'd really love to be involved in that. But yeah. she can't get up to Kendall and there's so little guide training around. So I, I thought, I, I don't even really know where she lives, but she said she could access Bristol. So I was like, right, That's I know okay. just yeah. the people. Um, so that yeah. could be great. Yeah, and um, there's always someone up to do park run on a Saturday if she... Yeah, wanted to go. Right. Well, so that would be a good thing to do as well. I'll pass yeah. it on and see what happens. Right now we've yeah. got to a point where we need to do those little spin ups of hard bits. So mm -hmm. for a whole ten seconds, you're all going to need to not talk because you're <laughs> going to be going fast, too fast. So it's that very high cadence, very fast, powerful spins. I'll just wait for Teresa to get a jacket off because if she puts enough power in, she'll fall off the bike if she's not holding on. <laughs> <laughs> and we don't want that happening. Okay, are we ready to get to go? Three, two, okay. one, go. Ten seconds. Five gone. Ten gone. Relax. Spin your legs out for 50 seconds and then we're doing that again. We've got at least two more. How was your race? Did you have a good fun, you and Steve? How was it, Steve? It was good, yeah. Like so. <laughs> well done, yeah. No stress on that course. No what, sorry? No stress whatsoever. Oh, good. Ideal for I being see, I see you beat last year's time. Blinking act, Linda. <laughs> Stalking you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, you did. You did, did, didn't you? Steve, we were about nine minutes 41 better than last year. Wow, that's brilliant. Wow. I'm happy. Gosh, I was embarrassed really last year. I had a really bad race, so I had to come back <laughs> for Steve and rest. <laughs> okay. Three, two, one, ten seconds. Three, two, one, and spin out. We'll do one more of those. What was that, Jill? I said, were you the weakest link last year? I most definitely was. <laughs> and I will always be the weakest link cycling with Steve. <laughs> like, you've got this turbo charge on the back. That's all right. I'm just point the bike in the right direction and left into the work. It's great. It is. It's really good. I love it. I'm never going to go that fast on my own. I've just got to make the most of having this engine on the back. <laughs> you thought you were flying. Well, I did at points. And Steve's right. 
I do need to post on the WhatsApp group. I'm just watching the clock you've got. We're going again. Three, two, one, 10 seconds. Three, two, one, relax. Okay, so we've got rid of some coats and tops and uh, there's been a bit of silence. So I'm hoping that most of you have managed to warm up. <laughs> <laughs> right, we're going to do a little bit of overgeared effort work. So that's when we put the resistance right up and we have a quite a slow cadence. And then we're going to put that into riding a circuit in preparation for next week. So we're going to do just two times two minutes of overgeared work. So I'll find the cadence for you. Metronome. What are you doing next week, guys? Um, we're going to have one more session. Oh, sorry, I thought you meant it was a, a cycling weekend. Oh, no. We had this discussion. This is the last official session. And I'm going to do one next week. But ah, I'll get you started on this. So we're going to do two minutes of tick, tick, tock, tick, tock, tick. Oh, that's 90, hang on. <laughs> oh, that was very fast for what I wanted. That's better. Tick, tock, tick, tock, <laughs> tick, tock, tick, tock. So alternate knees need to be coming up. And it's quite, that's good, it's quite slow, but it should feel as if it's quite a hard resistance. So you're pushing, it looks fantastic on here. It looks like you're all doing really well. And you should feel your glutes working. Your core should be turned on, so you're holding your upper body quite still. You're not yanking with your arms. All the power is driving through the bottom of the bike. And you've got one more minute. So, yeah, we're going to do a last one, Jill. And what people asked last week was, would I talk them through one of my favourite rides? Um, so we're going to have a bit of a mixture. And I don't quite know how this is going to pan out. But we're going to ride from my house through Burnie side of Boston <laughs> and Staveley and over Troutbeck and down around oh, Oswald and through Pudding we Bridge. When I was in lockdown, we were doing um, race routes in uh, lockdown with the countdown and Switzerland and stuff. It's very oh, fun. No. Nice. So, so yeah, we're going to try and repeat something after that. <laughs> so you'll have lots of description and lots of my history of what's happened at various bits and then we'll do over geared up oh, folks and minutes. spin down. Oh. No, you've got 10 seconds oh. left, Linda. <laughs> Three, two, one. Okay, you've got half a minute to just spin that out, and then we're going to do another two minutes. And I think uh, Liz had said fancy dress. I don't know if we have a theme. Uh, um, ten seconds to go. Maybe we should wear proper cycling gear. Three, two, one. Yeah. <laughs> Off you go again. Slow cadence, high gear. Tick, top, tick, top, tick, top, tick, top, tick, top. Lovely. Oh, I think some headgear might be nice. Yeah, what about a proper cycling outfit, you know, with um, cycle helmet and just a normal... <laughs> oh, do you want a silly hat? Can I have no, a silly I hat? Haven't got, I haven't got anything. You could make one. You must have a cycle helmet, Linda. I've got a helmet, yeah. There you go, sorted. But that's not, that's not a silly hat, is it? No. <laughs> <laughs> You've got you another, can decorate it. another minute. You can decorate anyway, it. Yeah. 
Oh, I've still got 50 seconds. Yeah, you could decorate a cycle helmet. Could stick something through it or on yeah. it. You mean I have to sit here not on my bike, but with my cycle helmet on? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, so maybe I have to ride it with you. Maybe I actually have to get on my bike this time. Well, I can make a cake. That would be nice. I can make a cake for the cake stops, but then I'd have to eat it all myself, wouldn't I? So <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I'd be watching, so I might even get slightly jealous. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we're coming up. Five seconds or so. Three, two. One, relax. So that should feel hard work in a different way to working hard. The muscles should be feeling that that's quite difficult to do. Um, but your lungs and your heart, your heart rate should still be relatively low. And so it's kind of strength training and it's good for hills. It's not great for knees. So if you've got, sorry, Linda, slightly dodgy knees, you're better off. <laughs> trying to keep a higher cadence. Oh, that's all right. It doesn't hurt my knee. So we're going to do a limited amount of that, partly because of that. Um, we're now going to wrap that, now we've had a practice, into some medium hard work, then straight into overgeared effort. So again, we're changing the stress. So we're going to do two minutes of medium hard. So you might be able to get some words out, but you shouldn't be able to speak that clearly. And you all look pretty much ready to go. And um, then you're going to go straight okay. into two minutes of overgeared. Three, two, one, go. Two and minutes, medium hard. So 90 okay. cadence. So you're back to Nelly the elephant. Back to bags and off she went to the circus. Or staying alive, if anyone can do that one. Staying alive. <laughs> Staying alive. Staying alive. Liz is normally good on these. Staying alive. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 30 seconds gone. I'm working hard, so I can't sing. Sorry. I'm quite glad to hear that. <laughs> Not because I don't like your singing, but because I like my sessions to have some form of impact. <laughs> which they obviously do if Esther's got gold stars on the velodrome absolutely <laughs> they, they didn't believe me they said it looks like you've always done it oh, hey <laughs> okay anyway, mini gone happy. I managed to book my first weekend no. with the VOA Brilliant. Well, I, am, I booked my first weekend. Yeah. The, uh, actually, it's, it's quite in, in a while. It's in September. It's the multi activity one at the end of September. Excellent. Yeah. Oh, that's good. Uh, you got half yeah. a minute. As a first one, I think it's nice to try a multi-activity one so that I can do other things as well. Yeah, agree. Ten seconds. Five seconds and then we're going to go into the overgeared effort. Change to slow, high resistance. Lovely. Great watching this. There's a, now an absolutely amazing clear cut difference. And like when we first started this, there certainly wouldn't have been. <laughs> I'm going to do this just for a minute. So you've only got 10 seconds. Three, two, one. And just relax for half a minute or so. 
And then we're going to repeat that. <coughs> Twenty second, uh, twenty seconds, ten seconds to go. In fact, no, no it's medium. Yeah, medium hard. Three, two, one, go. Medium hard for two minutes at a nice, happy, fast cadence. Lovely, Linda. Your cadences are so much better. They're really good. Well done. <laughs> okay, half a minute gone. <laughs> and Jill, you were only going to do one day and you ended up guiding two. What was that? Did you end up guiding two days? I ended up uh, day and a half. Right, yes. nice. I think it help, help Jill out of a bit of a <laughs> hole. With, <laughs> with Liz Ill. <laughs> Minute gone. Half a minute to go. Ready to change? Five seconds. Three, two, one. One minute of overgeared. So one minute, slow, full of resistance. Lovely. Halfway through. <laughs> Nearly there. Three, two, one, relax. <laughs> Okay, All right, we're going to incorporate that. We're going to, I'm going to do a 10 minute block of different things. So you're not going to know what's coming until I say it, but a little bit of riding on a course. So we're going to start steady and we're going to do a fast cadence downhill. And then we're going to do really hard for a bit because we're chasing someone. Then we're going to hit a hill. So I'm going to run it through like that. Mm. And we'll see how it goes. When you say hard, do you mean like faster cadence, but on a like? Um, the hard bit will be, yeah, quite a fast, but not really fast. So you're going to do it for a minute or two minutes. I'll see how how we go, how close right. we are to catching someone in my head at that point. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, so so it won't be like the ten second spin up. But it will be like you're working really hard. Yeah, so, it won't be like over, it won't be like over There will be a bit of overgeared when you hit the hill. But I'll talk you through it all. All right. So okay. we're going to start off nice and steady for oh at least a minute. So mm. we're just getting going. We're getting settled in. Got our positions <laughs> right. We're getting our breathing <laughs> under control and all sorted. <laughs> getting comfy. 
And then we're going, the first thing that's going to happen is we're going to hit a downhill. So Ooh. we want you to do quite a fast cadence, but not too much power. So when we do those kind of 100, 110, 120 things, and that won't be for another minute or so. So just hold your fire. I'm just warning you. All right. <laughs> Have you got a neighbour called Helen who's a long distance swimmer? A neighbour? Yes. I go to Colin Hill who lives up. No, no, no. Just um, a lady called Helen. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I was just chatting to her earlier because she's moving to Alverston. Yeah. <laughs> I think we've known each other from our long distance swimming races before. so. Right, yeah, she's living in Pip's house. Sorry, I thought you said Colin. No, no, sorry. <laughs> um, but yeah, I have. She's borrowed a house from our neighbor, well, my friend and our neighbor. Okay, oh, 10 you. seconds. And then you want to be spinning 100 to 110, but some resistance. So you want a nice, steady yeah. three, two, one, fast cadence, not too much power. So it's like you're trying to make your bike go faster downhill, but you're running out of gears. Mm -hmm. And you've got 30 seconds at that. You've got 10 seconds and then we're going to chase someone, but it's quite a long way. So it's a medium <laughs> hard effort. Three, two, one, now. So you're digging in, two minutes, medium hard effort, because you've come down the hill, you've hit the flat, and you can see someone ahead of you. And Jill's immediately got down on her bars, and she's tested, <laughs> you can see that, right? You're going for it. <laughs> Not competitive at all, no. No. <laughs> Halfway through. And you're kind of gaining a little bit, so you're going to keep that pressure on. Because you know if you go much harder than this, you're going to blow up. <laughs> oh, my gosh got half a minute and at the end of that you're going to decide that this isn't quite good enough and you really do want to get past them because they're really irritating you so you're going to ride really hard for 30 seconds so <laughs> <laughs> also fast yeah but lots of resistance as well so okay. quite a fast cadence so okay three two one go so quite similar to the starting sprint but for 30 seconds so it's quite hard yeah. 10 seconds to go you're going to get them you're going to get them five seconds Oh my gosh, now you look up and you see there's a hill coming, so you transfer <laughs> to medium hard, medium hard as the slip starts to go on. You've got 30 yes. seconds of medium hard. And then the hill is really going to bite, so you have a choice. You can stand up or you can go to overgeared, so slow cadence. Three, two, one, stand up or over geared. <laughs> For a minute. What now? Yep. Oh. 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 Halfway up this hill. Well done, folks. You're getting there. <laughs> Twenty seconds. Oh. 
Five, three, two, one. You're coming over the crest of the hill. You keep some power on and you go into medium because you want to keep your momentum. You don't stop to get your breath on the top of the hill because you lose all that that you've just gained. So 30 seconds of medium hard. And then the hill is getting steeper going down. So we're going to have a fast cadence, but not too much resistance. Three, two, one, now. So again, a bit like your gears are quite easy. You're going down, going down, going down. Lovely. And you're coming to it evening off. So you're going to go back to medium. Three, two, one for one minute. <laughs> And you're looking ahead and you can see that there's the second hill of the circuit, but this isn't quite, it's a bit longer, so it's going to be over geared unless you're a real sucker for punishment. We're going to do two minutes. <laughs> No. No, 20 seconds. Ten seconds to go. Five, three, two, one, and you've hit that uphill. Two minutes of high resistance. Slow pedaling. Well done. So this is kind of vaguely reminiscent of Sunday. I don't know if Steve recognises it, but it's kind of similar. <laughs> Lovely. How long did you do cycle on Sunday? Um, an hour and about ten. Oh, okay. So we ran for, for about 55 minutes, then we got on the bike. And did an hour, and then we got off, and we did another run. Mm. It was a bit shorter, about half an hour. Um, Fifty seconds. Mm. Half a minute, nearly there. <laughs> And it is only 10 past 8, so you still have 20 minutes. <laughs> okay, I would now be showing kind of 30 yards to go, so you've got 15 seconds. Grass coming up. Five. And you're going to go into medium hard because it's levelling off. Three, two, one. Now, rather than the steady bit, you don't have a steady bit when you go on the second circuit. So it's medium hard until we hit a downhill. So if you need a break, we're going to do two minutes here. Take the break because we're basically going to repeat that or something very similar. <laughs> okay. <coughs> <clears throat> we need some of Steve's power. Yep. But there are times when you do slack off because you need to eat or you've got to get a drink or your legs are seizing up or whatever it happens to be. So if you need that, take it in these two minutes. Yeah, I think. 
<laughs> Brilliant. Hey, Liz, I'm so pleased you've done some running again. That's great. Yeah. It's really nice. Yeah. Okay, we're coming up for one minute. So you should be, unless you're taking a break, it should be that nice cadence of about 90. So the fast, <laughs> not really fast, but quite fast. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. And even if you are um, taking a break, you still want to keep your legs going around reasonably quickly with very little resistance because that will help them recover. Half a minute to go. And then we're going to do the downhill. So fast cadence, little resistance, but you've got half a minute yet. Well. <laughs> No, 15 seconds. Three, two, one, fast cadence for a minute this time. You got a bit brave going down the hill, so you're going to go faster. So quite a fast oh look at that spin Esther quite a fast spin but not much resistance <laughs> nice job <laughs> right you're going to have about 20 seconds so when I give you the count you're going to go into medium hard. You've come down the bottom of the hill and you really want to use your momentum to just power forwards. Three, two, one, medium hard for two minutes. You've got just a bit of undulating road, making the most of it. And you're just getting that power on. Lovely job. Cadence of 90, so that regular one that we're heading for. Yes, <laughs> ah, that's okay. Esther, I think it's your camera. It was suddenly going really, really fast, like Mickey Mouse fast, and then stopping. Oh, okay, that was the camera. <laughs> <laughs> and then starting again. I was like, oh, that's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> Right, you've got another minute. Halfway through that two minutes. And you know it's coming at the end of this. You're going, going to go into that 30 seconds of fast chasing. So that bit's hard. Five seconds. Three, two, one, 30 seconds of hard. Fifteen. Three, two, one, back into medium because the hill's coming up. 30 seconds of medium. You've still got 15 seconds, but we're going to standing or over geared, your choice. But only for 30 well, seconds, it'll vote for a minute. Now. Three, two, one, now. One minute. 
Standing or slow resistance pedaling? Well done. Thirty seconds. Halfway through. Brilliant job. Ten seconds. <clears throat> and you're going to medium for thirty seconds. Three, two, one. Sit down, back to 90 cadence, medium. Bless you. Thank you. <laughs> Five seconds, and you're going for that fast cadence, easy resistance. Three, two, one. So spinning down the hill. Hitting the base in five and going to medium. Three, two, one, medium for one minute. Well done. 40 seconds still though. And then we go back to over geared for two minutes, but not yet. Oh, no. 30 seconds. Because this is the bigger hill on the second circuit. <laughs> Ten seconds. Five seconds. Overgeared effort. Two, one. Overgeared. Two minutes. And when you ride circuits, the hills just seem to get bigger and bigger the more times you ride around them. <laughs> Half a minute gone, you're quarter of the way through. <laughs> we did run intervals one day with the group, and on the first efforts, everybody thought the ground was flat. By the 10th or 12th one, it was definitely a hill. <laughs> <laughs> it was a very high level, like a 3%. <laughs> it's still got a minute to go on this one. Still got 30 seconds, and even from my perspective, this seems like a long time, but I, I'm not <laughs> cheating, honest. <laughs> You're nearly at the top. You've got 15 seconds left. You can see the top. You can almost touch it. Well done. Five. Three, two, 
One, one oh. and into medium hard. This is your last two minutes. So if you have anything left that you want to do more than medium hard with, that's fine. <laughs> However, if you're quite happy to stay in medium hard, we'll do that. Mm -hmm. I think we should do a sprint finish. Okay, at the end of two minutes, I will give you a sprint finish. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see who wins. <laughs> you certainly could get a more keen group, could you, Kat? No. <laughs> You're always up for anything. <laughs> You've got another minute. Forty-five. What do you reckon, Liz? Fifteen, thirty, forty-five, or a minute? Um, <laughs> minute? No, thirty seconds. <laughs> A minute, a minute, let's go for a minute, a minute. Oof. <laughs> okay, win, at least one. <laughs> okay. You are, 30 you seconds are not... then, 30 seconds. Well, let's split the difference, 45. Right, you've got 15 <laughs> seconds. <laughs> Five seconds. Three. Two, one, 45 now seconds. I've done the last as you can. <laughs> last final burst of effort. <laughs> 30 seconds left. Fifteen seconds left. Last fifteen seconds. Last ten. Five. Three, two, one. The finish line. Very well done. Ooh. You know, that's the sweatiest I've been. <laughs> <laughs> that was probably about 20 minutes of continuous work, which is probably the, the biggest amount we've done without having some kind of break. You said it's only going to be 10. Well, it was two circuits. Well, I suppose, right. Okay. <laughs> I was like, I must admit that. So it was 10 seconds, of, uh, 10 minutes of circuit. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, Jill. It's right. good. I like that. I'm myself Sorry, Jill, your sound is quite fuzzy, so it's quite difficult sometimes to pick my, up. My sound is terrible. I can hardly hear. If I'm pedalling. Yeah, right, yeah. On this bike, I can't hear you either. So. <laughs> You're guessing really well. <laughs> <laughs> From what I can see, okay, this is time to just chill it out a bit. So resistance down, reasonably smooth, still with a reasonable cadence, so that your circulation is still sending lots of blood around to help the muscles. Remove all the waste products. And make sure you have a drink. If you want to move around and do so. But this is, we're now just spinning out for five minutes. 